This course was designed by the Australian Embassy in combination with Indonesia's Communication and Informatics Ministry to help support the Cyber Kriasi Initiative so that we could build digital media literacy in Indonesia. It's a very important thing to build the capacity of Indonesian organisations and every individual so that they can use social media in ways that promotes tolerance, harmony, community development. We do know that a lot of Indonesian researchers have identified that the public is very concerned about the number of hoaxes that they receive and the damage this is causing to development and community cohesion. This program brings together change makers who are really trying to improve the overall culture and make sure that Indonesians can pull together and have a better, stronger future through the way that they communicate on social media. This program is very useful for me as a journalist who has been in the industry for more than nine years. So I find it very useful. And here I realize that journalism is not only about informing or um, revealing something, but it's also about education, how to educate the public to be media, digitally literate. So I get that sense from this program. The reason why I joined this program is because uh, we, are, we have been facing a lot of uh, challenges in terms of misinformation and also hate speech that's been going around for the, fa for the past few years in Indonesia. At the same time, we are also, uh, I'm also experiencing that there is a, a huge threat towards uh, the democracy that we, that we have enjoyed for the last 21 years. There has to be something we have to do more but in order to do that, we have to, we have to learn first to help uh, the country. The objective of this program is to discuss and benchmark success stories in channeling social media in direction to positive changes. What I have got for the past four days uh, wow, that's a lot. We've had lectures that is so amazing and mind-opening. Uh, it opens lots of possibilities for us uh, to explore. And then we've also come to many different institutions. There's the city council, the parliament, the public library, and also the police force. We've seen how everyone basically that we have encountered have put everything that they have, giving a service to people. Actions and programs are, that have been done in so many places are like the city council and the libraries and, and by the police force and everything. It's very heartwarming to see that actually the one thing that makes a huge difference is it's not about how much you know, but about how much you are willing to give your best to serve other people. For me, I'm going to take it, to take it home with me to uh, be one of the guidance that I'm going to use. The important aspect of this course is to provide practical examples by digital and media literacy programs and to connect Indonesian experts and agencies with Australian stakeholders who are already invited in this program. So I encourage other fellow Indonesians to join forces, apply for this program because this program is very, very useful and beneficial. So, and I'd like to thank you Australia Awards and Queensland University of Technology. This is something that useful and I believe this is a once in a lifetime experience about digital and media literacy.